I know what you're wondering, Davide, why do you review an e-bike? Well, let me explain you. Many bike companies contact me to review their e-bikes and it usually never works out for twofold. Either I don't like the product or the logistics are, uh, are not working because I'm traveling in different places. But when Van Powers contacted me, it was a little different because uh, the logistic sort of worked and uh, I like the, the bike. They didn't pay me to review this bike, but I do get to keep the bike and I will sell it. So this is, a, I always say that you don't need a fortune to cycle around the world and you need to be resourceful. And when an opportunity comes your way, you, you need to take it. And so I will sell the bike and uh, probably I will have to sell it a little cheap because in Almeria there isn't a big market for this kind of bike. We are in Almeria, see the, the beach, the city over there. Uh, I will sell, I'll have to sell it uh, less than half of the, the retail price, but at least probably with the money that I will be able to, to earn from this, I will be able to pay the health insurance. Van Powers get to showcase their uh, cool little bike and uh, the person that buys the bike gets it to a very high discount so it's a win-win-win situation now why do i like the city van power which which is a is a city bike well look at this it has a bell drive gates carbon drive cdn now look at my new t-shirt put one and one together and uh, you will have my aspiration for my next bike it might not happen but it might happen so i wanted to try a bike with a with a belt now let's dive right into what the city venture has to offer first of all it's an affordable city bike uh really retails uh, 1600 euro 1600 you buy directly from van powers website it has a very cool design who would use uh, or what are the use uh, for, a, for a city bike like this? In my opinion, you would, need it, you would use it to commute, to go to the gym, go to the supermarket, go shopping, go to dates. And you might not want to arrive in this place is sweating. So you might want to use the assist of the electric motor. It has a very cool and sleek design in my opinion. This is the infinite silver uh, color. It has these accents, colors of the um, that makes it a cool design. So the the tires, the saddle, and the grips are uh, a very similar color. It's quite uh, comfortable to ride and smooth. The saddle has uh, two springs at the back, so it has a little uh, suspension. It doesn't even look like a, an e-bike because the motor is hidden in the hub and the battery is hidden in the down tube. But the main characteristic and the peculiarity of this bike that makes it quite different in the bike of this category is the bell drive. Uh, it's a carbon uh, drive CDN from Gates. It's a very famous um, American company that makes uh, bell drive. The belt uh, is uh, advantageous uh, compared to the chain because you don't need to clean it you don't need to lube it uh, sometimes it might get dirty with mud very difficult but you just need to to spray it with a bit of water and it's clean uh, another advantage is because you don't have to lube it and it doesn't get dirty if you are uh, cycling and your um, pants goes and touch the belt it doesn't matter because you don't uh, it doesn't get dirty so you don't need to hide your pants inside uh, inside your socks with the with this battery the um, the range is about 80 kilometers quite standard with a 250 uh, watts motor with a with a cadder with a cadence sensor that these are usually the, the same uh, kind of motor and battery that are in, uh, in bikes of this category. Van Powers also sell an extra battery 
that you can fit here it looks like a water bottle and with that extra battery you can exchange, extend the range from 80 to 130 kilometers in my opinion for this kind of bike is uh, is not necessary because it's something that you uh, only use inside uh, uh, the city this is the part where you plug in uh, the charger it's a small charger about this size and uh, uh, you can fully charge uh, the battery in a little bit over uh, two hours. It sports the same pedals that I use on my traveling bike, on my Felicity. And it's a Chinese company called Welgo. I never use pedals so good in my, in my entire cycling life. I use them now for 45,000 kilometers and they spin like they were new. I would sense that these are uh, are very similar and they will be just as good they will probably outlast uh, the whole bike the brakes are from tektro they are hydraulic disc brakes so you can uh, control the braking very well the little computer is integrated very well in the handlebar system and it's controlled by three buttons one to turn it on here and these two buttons to cycle through the different settings. As it's standard on uh, all the bike of this category, there are five levels of pedal assist, while six is you consider off. When it's off, you just pedal with your own, uh, with your own power. And then there is echo number one, normal number two, tour number three, power number four, and boost number five. It has a convenience bike stand for where you need to park it and also a cool looking bell. It comes uh, in, a, in a small box, so it takes a little longer to put together, at least let's say a couple of hours. It's come into many pieces, so you can see different pieces, and you put and you put them together. You can see the sticker: 11, 5, 6, 4, 10, 15, 1, 2, 16. So you basically put them together like uh, Lego pieces, and you use these bolts to screw them in connect the cables it's very very easy very I, I could do it so anybody could do it really that's it if you're on the market for a for a cool city bike check out the vampowers and uh, i'll see you soon ciao